The wedding industry, the billion dollar industry. First step is to do a demonstration for the bride and groom seeking their approval on colors and concepts. Next, I quickly jump into the shower, getting ready for my day. I never leave home without breakfast. I always make sure I have some carbohydrates. A cup of a hot beverage and definitely, definitely fruit. I never skip fruit with my breakfast. That way I'll be powered through the entire day. I love it with syrup. The full uh, episode for the French toast is linked in the description box. Off we go to town. Welcome to Uganda's Deco headquarters. A rural park. Hundreds of thousands of people earn their daily bread from the event deco industry. It's an entire ecosystem. From store owners to designers, event planners to florists to electricians to transporters to laborers to lorry owners and lorry drivers. It's an entire ecosystem where everyone plays a part in the, produc in the production process. You choose what uh, chairs you'd like. Look at a laborer helping with the uh, carrying items. Here we see the before and after of the hanging enchanted garden. Florists, so beautiful. Look at that. <laughs> We have locally grown flowers and lots of flowers imported from Kenya as well. Meanwhile, watch the tent go up at the site. Most weddings these days are garden ceremonies. It takes a team of dedicated, strong men to set up the tent making sure that it's secure to make sure that uh, the tent might not encounter any kind of safety mishaps tent installation was done on thursday afternoon So while well, the tent is going up at the venue, I and my assistant of the day, Darius Ruthie, <laughs> thanks girl, we are in the deco headquarters procuring the items that we shall use for our design concept. It's uh, just like that, it's uh, evening, 7, 8 o'clock. We load our items that we've uh, carefully curated onto our lorry. A team of several 
Hardworking strong men help us load the lorry. We are super tired and, and hungry so we run to KFC, grab some snacks and then continue to the venue. We go to the venue to make sure everything is going well. We wait for the lorry to deliver items. Then we go home. At this point it's close to midnight and we are super exhausted. However, the more items you are able to clear from the to-do list days before the wedding, the less stressful the actual wedding day will be as you try to sort out all the different moving parts. Next day, I get up. First thing I do is uh, spend some time with my creator, God Almighty, by reading his holy word. Next I run into the shower. I love, 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 love this lemongrass shower gel. The fragrance is uh, quite citrusy. So it makes me feel like I just got a burst of energy right in the morning. I start to bathe um, with my exfoliating gloves. Try to move fast because I'm running late. Dress up and head for breakfast. I always make sure to have some fruit, either, either as a fruit salad or a fruit with my breakfast. From fruit, you can get vitamin C. Check this out. Oh my goodness, our team walked through the entire night. After the tent was installed, a deco team that arrived at about midnight started to do the draping. The draping is that white fabric that you see inside a tent. They've also installed the hanging gardens and chandeliers on the top of the tent to add some beauty and glamour to the top of the interior of the tent. It takes a team of several people, as you can see. The supply chain, the, uh, all the participants in the ecosystem, tens and hundreds and thousands of people. The walkway and the stage are coming up. The chairs we are delivered here and will soon be set up to install into the tent. <laughs> Team players are a little bit exhausted so we take a break for lunch and then return. At this point, more people have joined the team and it's literally full-blown spare setting up the chairs and dressing them the roof of the tent these are the chairs bare the walkway is set up the stage is set up with wood installations and just with PVC it's coming together nicely check that out Oh wow, I like I like the effect that the mirror adds to the setup. Everything is coming together nicely. Look at that. <laughs> hi guys. Say hi to my assistant. <laughs> Working super hard. Thanks, sweetheart. Thank you so much. <laughs> We add some decorative glasses in copper color and gold. The electrician is setting up the lighting inside the hanging garden. Over here we see the team in charge of uh, the high table working on the items that they will set up on the backdrop. Thanks Shafiq. 
Shafiq did a really wonderful job. Very intricate as you can see, there's no room for error. At this point, time check is about 12 hours to the D-Day. It's coming together nicely, wow. I have my flask with me so I can sip, keep sipping on tea. Wow, everything is coming together so beautifully. <laughs> Things you see behind, uh, behind the curtains. Things are taking shape, nice and beautiful. That's Shafiq. Thank you so much, Shafiq. He did a really wonderful job. We continue setting up the tables and chairs. We are done with the linen and now we are dressing the chairs. Our concept, uh, our color palette for the day is white, gold, and green. I must say it's coming together nicely. Oh, wow. Check that out. This is going to be the high table. I love the, the look of this weed. <laughs> it's a plastic weed that uh, is created from the inspiration of a weed out in the gardens. Everything is coming together so elegant. Wow, check that out. Wow, love it. Love it, love it, love it, love it. Oh my goodness. Nice. <laughs> My team has surely, surely done an awesome job. In case you would like us to do the deco for your event, do send us a message. <laughs> announcement! Public service announcement! <laughs> and now the sun has gone down. It's about 7 to 8 o'clock. We have about 12 hours left until the morning of the wedding and as you can see we have managed our time well since we started work on Thursday actually on Wednesday the more of the work you do before the D-Day the less stressful maintaining all the moving parts will be oh wow check that out nice and now the cleanup where we wrap up the entire setup i must say it's really come together nicely wow very nice <laughs> So as you can see, it takes an entire ecosystem to set up wedding decor. Close to 20 people on site, adding the people in the stores, it could come close to 50 people. So the wedding industry supports so many people to be able to care for themselves by earning a fair wage. Don't be afraid to ask us to do your event decor. <laughs> Wow, 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 wow. I'm literally blown away as well. <laughs> Yet was there the entire time <laughs> from the stores to the action, but watching it back now in video, I'm like taking it all in in detail and I'm like, this was really nice. Really, really nice. Wow, check this out. Love it, love it, love it. I love it. Very nice.
since the decoy is almost done we will zip it up and there will be security on site to make sure that nothing is removed from the tent and the team goes away to rest and eat dinner Wedding day, wedding day is here. Wake up, wake up, wake up. I have to run. Oh my goodness, I have to run. But first things first, I start with my reading for the day. Speaking to my creator and dedicating the day for success. Getting ready. <laughs> breakfast time. I make sure never to leave home without breakfast. Never, never, never. The full recipe for the French toast will be available in the description box. I have a cup of tea. Try to hurry up. Faster, faster, faster. Faster girl, faster. First step is to run to the florist. That will be doing the bridal bouquets. We have to move fast now, time is running out. We try to finalize the floral bouquets. Drive across town to the hotel where the bride and entrage are dressing from to hand over the bouquets as they head to church. The church service going really well. And then our decor, everything came together nicely. Bride and the groom so happy. <laughs> happy, happy family. Happy bride, happy groom, happy family. And we are totally delighted. Thanks for your time, guys. <laughs>